Good morning, this is Tony Gibson. Um, I hope we are, all you folks are, are well. And uh, I'm going to be doing a, a little bit of a review on the Zebroya Kozak. So the Kozak uh, rifle that they've, they've got, um, it'll be something that might impress you guys. It's impressed me so far. It's a really nice Ukrainian made rifle. It's really, really stable, shoots well. I'm impressed. It's a 5.1, uh, sorry, a 5.5 millimeter, 0.22 uh, air rifle. It's a PCP. It's got a 220 cc capacity tank. And out of that, you're gonna get around 40 shots if you load it to 300 bar. And um, you'll see that the the actual air rifle is really reliable it's very accurate I'm impressed so far so good let's put it that way okay let's quickly show you what the gun looks like that's it there very nice compact lightweight today we've got the uh, discovery VTR scope mounted on it quickly tell you a little bit about that it's a 3 by 12 by 44 um, it's got a mil dot scope and it's got lockable turrets really nice little feature pop them up rotate them pop it down again lock it in place okay cool so anyway let's show you a little bit more about the actual rifle it's got a really comfortable right or left hand uh, configuration you can see just holding it with one hand really light it's, it's really nice I'm really enjoying it okay. so the one thing about the actual weapon itself you've got a nice cheek rest which is spring-loaded and you just loosen that screw and you can adjust it to wherever you want and you know you can set it up pop it in there and get a really nice picture that I'm looking through over here ah, really cool okay good thing about it is that it's got a very very light mechanism for loading really really nice I'm not gonna uh, load it right now but very smooth it's it's superb easy to get to very smooth okay it's got a index index finger safety just while you're ready to fire slide it on slide it off um, yep very very comfortable it's not not these chunky little buttons on the side so very impressed by that it's very nice um, yep okay so let's chat about the gun over here the the thing is that you can fill it up to 300 bars uh, you know I might have mentioned that earlier and the thing is that it's got a regulator in it um, the regulator is about 150 bar so you'll be able to actually you know consistently fire your rounds and you're on target man it's really cool the um, you get around 40 shots per uh, 300 bar full and um, that's quite quite reasonable so it's really nice um, I'm finding that you know loading the magazines probably probably takes more time than actually filling the, the gun uh, it's yeah, one of those things okay so our shot rate the highest that we got was 916 foot per second and the lowest was 904 foot per second so it's not a very big you know range looking at 12 foot per second you know difference between the two and um, the consistent you know sort of consistency of it was about three foot per second um, it's that's saying something you know your shots are going to be pretty much on target every time with that sort of um, spec it's really cool okay so the the rest of the gun, the trigger, you can, it's got a two-stage two, um, two adjustable trigger. The one thing is that you have to actually take the stock off to be able to actually get to that mechanism. Um, it's not a train smash. Once you know what, you, what your setup is and you're happy with it, then that's great. You know, you're not going to be making uh, you know, that sort of adjustment very much. Right now, we've set it up that it comes straight out of the, the box. This is, this is like an out of the box uh, setup that we got over here. So whatever the, the manufacturer set it up as, that's where we, where we are at the moment. It's got a really nice wooden stock. Um, this one is a little bit of a, uh, uh, let's say a nice stain on it. It's really very, very pretty. Okay, good. So a nice little brass, you know, sort of fittings that round it off, even on the top over here, you've got nice little brass fittings on the, back of the barrel uh, sorry on the back of the cylinder as well okay now the one thing about this is that the actual barrel itself it's 
completely shrouded all the way up to this point over here. It's exceptionally quiet air gun. Um, when you fire it, it's definitely a backyard, you know, weapon. So you can you can definitely fire it, and it's really it's good. Nobody's going to know. The one thing about it is that it has got a little mechanical ping on it, um, but that's not a train smash. I mean, it's not going to be scaring off anything when you actually fire this. It's it's nice and quiet. Okay, cool. So let's see. What does this gun come with out of the box? Well, obviously the stock, the cylinder, you've got the filler probe, you also have two magazines, rotary magazines, there we go, and you've got your certificate and your passport as such. That's what comes in the box. So, easy, compact, very lightweight. Now we need to go shoot it. So let's go and have a look and see. Okay, so now I've set up the range, the target's around 25 meters maybe a little less um, let's go adjust the scope a little there we go yeah that'll work okay let's see how we do okay well it's on target See how that grouping goes now. It's got a nice light trigger pull. But remember, this is the way that it's set up out of the box. You can make adjustments yourself as you're going. Straight through the hole, so the grouping's good. Third shot, exactly the same place. Fourth shot, exactly the same place. Fifth shot, same place. Sixth shot, same place. Seventh shot, same hole. little bit above the others but still cutting the same page and again okay I thought that would be the last one okay just put the safety on put the well, magazine done. out Okay, so second round of shooting now, it's around 50 meters, um, new round uh, magazine of 10 shots, let's give it a go. Just focus the, the scope. Go fraction higher there. That's better. Straight through the se second hole. Ah. 
slightly above the second one. Again through the second hole. Okay, next to the third one. Right in the dead center. Again. Again. Okay, safety began. Zoom out. Okay, good. So that was on 50 meters. Grouping's a bit bigger, but uh, first shot was quite high, so you'll see that on the target now. So, in summary, let's take a look at the um, Sabroya Kozak air rifle. It's a really, really good PCP rifle. Um, it's finished off exceptionally well. It looks good. It's light. It's easy to handle. It's compact. It fits into just about anywhere. Um, 40 rounds per 300 bars of uh, you know fill. I mean, that's fantastic. It's actually not bad at all. Uh, 0.22. It's good for, for stopping power. And then the other thing is there's there's not much I can say that's bad about this thing. It's really, really comfortable. I like it. And uh, I think everybody should get one. So go and take a look at Extreme Air Guns. Uh, they'll be able to sort you out. ExtremeAirGuns.ca.za, Centurion based. They'll definitely be able to make a plan for you.